Let's go. Summer's gone, I'm latching on. Don't even know your name, but you're still in my head. Underneath rays of gold, your body oh so close. No, I can't forget. No. When I saw you on the dance floor, oh, I was a you who saw me first. I guess it's history now and I shouldn't care but it still hurts. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to be recreating this look right here using the last and third palette of the Jaclyn Hill The Vault collection that I picked up. Today's palette is the Ring the Alarm, which is, I feel like it's one of the best ones that I have, honestly speaking. So I decided to create this last look very easy, very simple for everyone to be able to do. I decided not to wear any eyeliner and I decided not to wear any falsies because I wanted to make one that it was easy for everyone to be able to do and honestly, I didn't want to spend so much time on my makeup today. So before we get onto the video and you guys see um, my thoughts on this palette, uh, how I feel about this palette and also um, how I created this eye look using the palette only the palette. I can't believe I only used this palette, guys, but I did. I only used this one. Before we get into the video, make sure you hit subscribe right down there. We're gonna get to 40K before the end of this year. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on because I am raining videos on your feed. <laughs> so if you guys want to see my thoughts on the last Jaclyn Hill palette from the vault and you guys want to see how I created this eye look, then let's go ahead on with the video. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start with the ring the alarm. We're gonna go ahead and start with bomb ass. Bomb ass is the first color. We are going to grab a shader brush and we're going to pack this on our lid all over a lid and don't be afraid to go a little bit upwards we're gonna make sure that we blend everything so we're just packing onto the lid as you can see using the same color a small shader brush so we can pack and then I'm gonna use a blending brush and I'm going to blend upwards I needed a bigger brush I'm going to blend upwards and then I'm going to mix the color with the color rush from the palette and I'm gonna make that my transition color and make it um, kind of blend with the ball mask color that I'm having right here. So I'm just pretty much blending back and forth and then I'm going to use the color on camera to put on top of the uh, ball mask. So it, it kind of gives it that orangey feel to the color and pretty much just that's it guys honestly speaking and then I do the same thing to the bottom part I use the color rush first and then I use a little bit of the color bomb ass on the back and it's um, just pretty much blending the colors now we're gonna pack on a lot of mascara you can use your favorites I'm using um, wander mascara and I'm using um, my uptime favorite from the drugstore at the moment the Maybelline total temptation and then that's it. I do. That's all I do to the eyes, guys. Honestly, that is as simple as this eye look gets. And then uh, my face. If you guys want to see something like how I do my face, you can see my other re my other tutorial that I'll link down below because it's pretty much the same thing. And just a little bit of highlight. I do my lips. I do a little bit of uh, soulmate highlight from Dose of Colors in the inner corner just to pop out. And then I draw. I outdraw my lips with a lip liner in a color orange. And then I go in with the color Mercury Rising from Jura Cosmetics as my liquid lipstick. And that's it, guys. That is as simple as this look it gets. Set me up like lemonade. We both know it's bittersweet. Ah, this sourness will bite your tongue. No one is forever young. using 
the palettes. I only picked up three, as you guys saw in my first Jaclyn Hill The Vault um, review slash tutorial, which it was Armed and Gorgeous. And I just uploaded the Bling Boss as well. So if you guys haven't seen that, I will link all those two videos down below. But today's video, I decided to use the last palette, which is uh, Ring the Alarm. And I have to say, honestly speaking, um, between all the three palettes I've used, I've noticed a very huge inconsistency with her palettes, with her mattes on all the different palettes, and I was just not feeling it. But honestly speaking, um, the colors that I used today from this palette worked very well together. Um, I did use one of her mattes on my eyes and it just, it was very pigmented and it blended very nicely. Um, I feel like this one by far is my favorite from her collection. I feel like, um, like I said, the shimmers are great. Um, the shimmers work really well together. The shimmers have very little fallout and an amazing payout. So I feel like, you know, her shimmers are great. Her mattes are not. Her inconsistency with the palette, unfortunately, Unfortunately, um, you know, the commotion and the whatever is going on between what ha really happened with the old palettes and new palettes, whatever, the vault is out there. People already bought it. Let's just make the best out of it. So that's what my feelings are on the Ring the Alarm. I feel like by far is my favorite palette from her collection, the ones, of course, that I picked up. And uh, I feel like I will continue to use her and I will continue to use her a lot. I told you it was very easy, very simple to do. I feel like anyone can create this look and I really wanted to make a like a truthful, truthful tutorial here on YouTube um, because I know sometimes we as beauty content creators, we can get very carried away with the um, liner and the lashes and some people are not up to that level yet. Honestly, I'm not up to that level yet. I created the way I can, I think it works for me. But I wanted to create this look for you guys. I wanted to make the last look very easy and simple and very um, easy to do, honestly, because it is very easy, honestly speaking. So anyways, guys, I really hope you like um, my reviews and my tutorials on the Jaclyn Hill palettes, the vault. I really hope that I was able to give you a little bit more information as to my thoughts on each of the palettes. So anyways, guys, I really hope that I was able to provide all the information you needed and also looks that you can recreate. I will definitely keep using this palette and create more looks for you guys. So if you like the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you have not yet to subscribe to my channel, make sure you hit it before you go. So thank you guys so much for your love. Thank you guys so much for your support. Muchos besos. I'll see you ladies on my following video. Adios.